Hey guys, today I'm going to be showing you my top 15 favorite webkins. I got a lot of requests to show my top 10, but I just couldn't choose, so I decided to do my top 15. So we're going to start with the back, which are my top favorite, and then we're going to go over here. It was really hard to pick since I like all my webkins, but I guess some of them are just kind of more special to me because I've had them longer or, I don't know, some sort of special thing to me. I don't know. But anyway, I'll start with the back. Um, these are my two rarest webkins. I don't think that one of them is better than the other. It's a tie for my first favorite with Periwinkle, my Sherbet Bunny, and Angel, my Love Puppy. Um, I got them, I think, more than a year ago. I got them Christmas 2008. So I've had them for a long time, but they're my most favorite. And then this is my Pegasus. She's also retired. Oh yeah, I'm probably going to show the W's because, yeah, they're rare ones, but yeah. Okay, and then this is my Pegasus, and her W's right here, and I've had her for, um, almost, like, I think I've had her for, like, a year and a half. I don't know, I've had her longer than, would you just cut it out and leave her tags alone on her rear end? Please, just leave her alone. She didn't do anything to you, did she, Buzz? Leave her be! No, 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 fine. She's going away now. Yep, you lost your privilege. Oh, gosh. Okay, um, anyway, so this is, um, Fantasia the Pegasus as my third favorite. Oh, my gosh. I'm trampling them all. Anyway, this is my next favorite, and I've had her for actually around four years because my aunt gave her to me, um, for a gift, like, four years ago, but... I didn't know it was a Webkin, so I didn't adopt her online because I didn't know what a Webkins was, but I figured out that she was my first Webkins, but not my first one online. This one right here, oh yeah, and by the way, she's a horse, and her name is Brownie. Yeah, I know, real original, but um, it was four years ago, so the name isn't very unique, I know. Okay, so this is the first Webkins I've ever adopted online. And I got him in February 2008, so that's when I started officially collecting Webkins. And he's chewing on the dress of my love puppy. Wonderful. Okay, anyway, so his name is Croker, and he's a spotted frog. And there's Fuzz, of course. Hello, Fuzz. Say hello to everybody. Oh, yeah, hi. Hey. He's getting fluffier all the time. It's unbelievable. Anyway, back to the video. Um, his tail's in the way. Whatever. This is Fuzz Tufty the Lamb, and she's not my favorite just because I named my, um, my cats after her. I actually just really like the Webkin's Lamb. Isn't that right, Fuzzer? Oh my gosh, he's trying to get my camera string. Anyway, so this is Fuzz Tufty the Lamb, and I really like her. I also have a Littlekin's Lamb, but I just like the big one better. I don't know why. Okay, this is my Cocker Spaniel, and she's not a Littlekin, she's a Bigkin's. And I don't really know why I like her a lot. I just do, because I've had her for a long time. And I got her with my friend, Violingal123. We went to Hallmark once and got her. And I also brought her to Chicago with me. And she, that's where she got the sweatshirt from Chicago. Um, yeah, and Tuft is trying to be the center of attention. Okay, and over here, if we just dodge Tuft. Oh my gosh, he likes the deer. Anyway, so this is my Coco Dinosaur. And to be honest, I'm not really sure why I like him so much. But for some reason, I just really like him. And his name is, what is his name? Dynamite. And, by the way, this one's name is Mella. I just, I don't know why I named her that, but I think it's really cute. My next favorite is Charm the Clover Puppy. I also like the Peace Puppy, but for some reason I like the Clover Puppy more. And Tuft is over there by the window, anyway. Yeah, I don't really know why I'm updating you on the cats, but whatever. So, this is Charm the Clover Puppy. Next, I have Jean Charlene, the brown dog, and I don't really know why I like her either, but I brought her to Chicago, and I think she's a really cute Webkins, so yeah. Next, we have Lorelei the deer, and I like this Webkins because she's both cute online and as a plush. I just think she's really cute, so that's Lorelei the deer. Next is Dreamer the dragon, the whimsy dragon, and I'm not really a big fan of pink, actually. I don't really like pink that much. But, um, I still like the Webkins. I just think it's cool. Next we have Tundra, the Arctic Fox. And I just really think this Webkins is, like, really cute. And I just really like it, like, all around. Like, it's virtual image and all that. Next we have Sprocket, the... 
Old English Sheepdog. And last but not least, this is... Okay, okay, okay. Please, 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 leave the camera alone. The camera loves you too, don't worry. Alright, and last but not... Please, please move. And last but not least is Squiggles the Caterpillar. And he... I just for some reason really like this Webkins. I like the color of it. And I just like the design, and he was like the first insect Webkins, I guess. So those were my top 15 favorite Webkins. I'm sorry this video was so long, my cats are distracting. What are you eating? Oh, that's a Webkins clothing piece. Anyway, so thanks so much for watching the video, and Fuzz, Tufty, and I will say goodbye now. So, yeah, we will miss you, and we'll see you in a different video. So, yeah, say goodbye, Fuzz. Here, put your hand up. Put your hand up. Here's a camera string. Yeah! Bye-bye! Bye-bye!